Neil? For us. Happy to do it. Okay. Uh, if, it's okay, if it pleases the committee, I'll have the interviews in alphabetical order. That's fine. That's fine. Okay. Okay. Yeah. Are you going to have the meeting in this room? Yeah, I think that works best. That worked, it worked well. Worked well last time. Kind of out of the way. One to five. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. We should be done probably before five. Okay. You want me to just find out and see? Well, Do you mind? Yeah. You, you literally know what I was thinking. Yeah. Make sure it's available. That's a good point. <laughs> make sure the room is available. And the, and the other reason I asked for Neil to be here, um, one, I thought this was quicker and easier just to confirm it like this. Um, but the other was I wanted y'all to look at. Um, he had sent out sort of a guide or questions, if you will. I wanted y'all to be able to review that and then ask him any questions and have any feedback that you need from him prior to that. Okay. Yeah. Yes. Yes. Yeah. Well, I saw the evaluation sheet, but I didn't see any questions any place. Well, the evaluation sheet, I'm sorry, is what I'm referring to. Okay. Um, I mean, I was going to talk about that would be the next thing to talk about, that we could almost use the same questions we asked the OPMs in a similar manner. You got a list of those that you can send out to us again? Yeah, I, I can, I've got that list in my computer. In fact, they got them probably in here. And Neil, you've seen those questions before. Do you feel good about that? I, I, re I remember answering them. I don't know <laughs> that I've never seen them in a list. <laughs> it's just, I mean, you're pretty familiar I, with them. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. It's good. Yeah. Tim, if you want to send those to me, I just will. so I can take a look at them. I, I think one thing we want to make sure that we ask in a non-qualifying way is that they are aware of the fee limitation that's expressed in the RFQ and they don't take any exception to it. Aware of the, what you call it, what did you call it? The fee. The fee, oh, the 12 fees, okay. It can always be less, but it can't be more, right? Right. right. Yeah. Do you have a list that you have on file that you usually use or anything? I, I I did send a list to Jennifer. And I forwarded it to you. Yeah, that was the evaluation sheet. I that was the only one I read. Hold on one second, Neil. Yep. I mean, I can share my screen if I'm allowed to. Yeah, go ahead and do that. That way they can yeah. see your face as you're doing it. I thought, Jim, that we kept you on all of our emails back and forth. Do you folks see that screen? Yes, yes, yes. sir. Yeah. Can you make it a little bigger? I can try.
Perfect. And Jim, I'll send you uh, a draft of the email invitation. Okay. I assume I assume the technology setup will be the same. Yes. Okay. Yeah. So all they'll need is a laptop and a presentation. We'll ask them for an electronic copy of any presentation materials they bring with them. Okay. Just so we'll have it for the record. Um, what is the anticipated duration? Going to go with uh, 60 minutes, 30 minutes for them, and 30 minutes for you folks? Do you want it shorter, longer? I, What's your preference? Well, if we send them the questions ahead of time, which I anticipate we would, they're probably going to answer a lot of these um, during the presentation, like everybody did for during the OPM. And I would say an hour total, however we want to break it up, but I think an hour per firm would be enough, or for 45 minutes. I think it was 15 minutes. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Say 45 minutes for the presentation and 15 minutes for the questions, up to 45 for the presentation um, and questions, and then. Um, Long presentation. Yeah, no, no, including yeah. oh, questions and presentation okay. and our questions. And your questions. So they can work in five, right? Yeah, okay. five, 15. For yeah. total. And then 15 minutes at the end where we can discuss after they leave. Okay, that's what you'll after that. Perfect. Yes. Okay. Yeah, 45 minutes of presentation would be very boring for them probably. <laughs> <laughs> they could probably lay foundation and that. Like well, my father, if I won't say it, because we're on TV, <laughs> I'll, say, I'll say it afterwards. But, uh, so, Jim, just to be clear, total duration of the interview is 45 minutes each candidate, is that right? Yes. Yes. Okay. So we're going to look for like 30 minutes of content from them Up and then front. allow 15 for Q&A and further discussion afterwards? Yes. Yeah. And we're going to provide them with the material that we want them to cover as part of the presentation? Correct. Yes. Okay. Yeah. If you leave the 15 minutes in between them, if y'all yeah. go over but I think right. that worked best with the OPM. They have the questions we're going to be asked. Pretty much answered them. Instead of firing a question for them, and they, they kind of, well, well, you know, if they have a chance to prepare, we're not trying to put anybody on the spot. We just want honest answers from everybody. And if we have the questions ahead of time, they're going to get a much better, better answer out of them. Okay. Because that's my opinion. You can always follow up on your answers. Too. Yeah. But we can always ask for better explanation. If you gave me the questions ahead of time. Right. right. Yeah. It, 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 I, it worked out well. Look at what it got you. <laughs> <laughs> no, no, I'm saying I don't think I got them ahead of time. Yeah, I, I thought you oh, did. Because yeah. no, you covered them all. Yeah, everybody covered them all. Yeah. yeah okay. I wasn't maybe I did. Yeah. yeah, I think maybe they, we, the questions were separate, but a lot of kind of covered in yeah. They what didn't we answer directly, but in their presentation, yeah. Yeah. They, they, they didn't go A, B, C, D. Right. Some, a couple of them did, but other ones kind of generally talked about the whole thing during their presentation. They they covered the topics, and yeah. I'm pretty sure you had them because you covered them all. I had to cover them anyway, so he might just well. be that good. Yeah, that might be it. Yeah. <laughs> Okay. Y'all have anything else for Neil? No. Okay. Good. Okay. Thank, Thank you. you. Thank, Thank you, you Neil. Neil. Thank you, folks. Have a good afternoon. You too. Thank you. <coughs> Thank you. <coughs> Bye. And I'm going to quietly pack up while y'all ready. Okay. Thank you. Thank, Thank you. you. Thank you for coming. We're ringing the stuff. Good job to have. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Um, do, you, do you, uh, like part of our thing here, do you think it'd be in the best of our interest, uh, whoever we decide, you know, choose to pick, go look at something that we did just to see? Before we make a decision. We could probably that would I would think you could probably do that. I'm just curious because obviously we went out and looked at one one of the questions we can I mean we're looking at the uh, <coughs> interviews. And they, and they may I would guess in here they probably give us examples. They have a few in there, I look. Yeah. And so we're not gonna meet until the twenty fourth, which is what almost three weeks away. Yeah. Two weeks away. 
So, um, so you're saying go look before we interview these companies? Yeah. Well, if, well, if, if we have three, two and a half weeks, we want to make a decision pretty soon after the interviews on who we go with, so we can get right into this thing going. And if we have two and a half weeks, well, we've looked at. Uh, We've already looked at yeah, the right. we yeah. looked at there, so this it just leaves the other two. The other two. Yeah, we, we've seen but Western I mean, and Samsung. But to go and look, we got it. we'd obviously have to ask them for yeah. make a contact in right. to where they come. Yeah. Jim, can I ask? Just, like, just looking quick, Northfield, Northfield, North Sheffield. Do you have Samson study to these farms? <clears throat> um, do you have all of the studies in hand already that oh. we've done? What do you call the study? The Weston Samson study, yeah. and then there's somebody said something about an older study that was supposed to be provided to you. I have, I have, all, I have the Weston and Samson stuff, mm -hmm. and the older study, what did the older study that was done prior to Weston and Samson? Mm -hmm. Yeah, I was the chairman of that committee. Do you have that did. study? Yes, I do. Can you email them I'll to me? Because it is not electronic. Oh, okay. Can you bring it to me so I can make it electronic? Yes, I believe I have it someplace at home. In fact, you should have a binder. You want to do it before? I don't know. I'm just drawing new binder. I would like to do it. I just like to do it. I like to do it. I say, obviously, on administrator's office. We got it's, a, it's about we got a one inch binder. Carolyn or like one or two of each. That's it. It was done. There's nothing like seeing it. I mean, this isn't. David Nixon was a, a cheap so project that we're in. It was great purge kind of transition, but I will double check. Okay. But if you get uh, it, I, I, yes, I get the feeling of the, the binder on, on the site. Oh, that would be great. They're really happy with that. And if I could get the West Sands, because Neil's asking for yeah, because that one, that one shop we got to these guys. And I have notes that I'll send you. The guy with the beard. The one that was done many years ago. I forgot the name. Yes, but all the propane. But that was, you know, that wasn't. Wasn't the Samson's Thank fault. You. No, just in general. No, I know. But it's good but, to find out. Yeah, but he, the guy's like, oh, overall, they were good to work with or whatever. He had his things he didn't like or whatever. Right. But overall, he's like, yeah, the experience was good. You know, they worked with us. Yada, yada, yada. Or something, yeah. you know. Well, they were a flop. We wish we never used them, you know. Right. Well, I guess I think we should go look at it either before or after the, you know, to make a decision. I well, the only the only thing about if you do it before you're viewing more places, if you do it after we interview, you can cut it down to whatever one company has and right. probably knock it off the following week. I don't care either way. Right, I, like you said, yeah. If you find if in the interview yeah, one of them started off, off. If you could, well, you're only going to look at. The two you already seen Weston and Samson. Right, right. So, so you look to the left. Other two companies. Right. But if you interview them and you're not impressed with their presentation, right. so I might knock yeah. something off. Right. Then right. you can go look at the second. Or you're not going to post. Yeah. Okay. Like I agree with doing it after the interview. Yeah. So okay. Won't take that long. That's fine. Yeah, we're looking at a half a day, only a couple yeah. hours. Now, is it going to work the same way where maybe we pick? Number one and number two, and then it's a negotiating thing, or is you, it just no, meet you, that? You, 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 during the during the interview process, there'll be no really fees discussed. That's right. that's right. actually right. illegal to do that. Right. They make the presentation. We evaluate them very similar to the way we right. did these guys, um, and you you know rank one, two, three, however we want to call it. one is high, one or low, whatever we want to decide we want to do. The one with the correct, with the lowest or highest score, depending which way we, which way we evaluate, is our number one choice. And then you bring them in, like we did here, and negotiate a fee. And they come in and they say, <coughs> you know, like we would, did with uh, these guys. The first company was was more expensive. Okay. And then you go to number two and number three. Then you come up with a company that agrees with our with the that meets our fee schedule and our needs. Okay. And it's possible none of them might. We don't know. But so of course they know the fee schedule. They know the fee, so they're all. And that that was what he said to make sure they knew what the ceiling was, right? Right. right. Yes. So that yeah. was right in. I guess the fees the fees from what I understand was right into the RFQ that they re put out. Okay. So we have to make sure that they're willing. Whoever we're interviewing. On this coming date, be willing to do it, right? With that fee. No, I, I think we used the words that he said. Are you willing to work with the fee schedule that was in the RFQ? Right, right. Okay. As opposed to the eight dollars and cents kind no, of. No, no, that's fine. We're not going to actually mention a price, but this is the fee schedule. 
you can live with that within that means. You would hope they wouldn't even be printing these yeah. books time. Right. Yeah, that's what I would. That's exactly that's what I would think. Be the ballpark. Yeah. They'd, yeah. they'd be wasting their time to look for more. The RFQ says you've only got two bucks. I'm just trying to understand what, what yeah. we're heading for. Yeah, mm -hmm. the and and that that's fine because the the state bidding process is like. It used to be many years ago, waste waste easier, um, but now it's like extreme. But I mean, even when going back, well, thirty-five years for the school, it was the same thing. You talk to the first firm. This is the price we have for the architects. Can you live within the, within the price? Yes or no. If not, they're all. You go to number two. So that's always been the case as far as what you know. Hyatt, you can talk to the, the best firm, negotiate, yes or no. Then you go to number two, and the bidding process is the bidding process is well. You guys know the same thing. You probably do too for the state stuff that you get your base price, and then you can what you can put add alternates to make sure that you stay within your budget. But the trick with add alternates is you. Let's say your base price is a hundred bucks, and you have a three hundred dollar budget. Okay, and your first add alternate is fifty bucks, and the second one is four hundred. Comes in at four hundred. Well, you can't. If your second one is four hundred, you've already exceeded your price, so you can't do it. Right. That doesn't mean you can go to number three. Right. Your add alternates are in order of prices, and if you hit once you hit your uh, Price range, you can't say secret. for hundred bucks Go left back. over. Yeah. You know how bucks left over. Well, number seven is fifty bucks. But everything before is exceeding your hundred. You can't no. skip. Right. So when you do that, you really got to try to get what you want in mind. Yeah, and we're. I, I, my my guess is we're probably going to have a bunch of that oh, yeah. to make sure that we stay within our budget for the overall building. So. Okay, all right. Um, Any else on the uh, interview? We're good with that. Be on the twenty fourth. Yeah. Set up a schedule when I get it. I'll get it. sent out questions yeah. and stuff. Uh, I'll, 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 I'll redistribute everybody the questions that we did for the OPM and I'll Neil's questions. And I'll send out get Neil's questions. We can look at them. I'll make a quick suggestion list and. Uh, you know, I don't know if we need a meeting. We can't just we can't make a decision on questions without having a meeting. Okay. I can do it myself as a suggestion, but nobody can come. We can't like okay, you, nobody can come back. Yeah, that's good. That's good. Add this. Add that. To make a decision, we really need to have an open meeting so that we're not circumventing that law. Okay. So if we need one, we'll have one. If not, we'll put oh, whatever. Um, and so we know. can all say in an email it's good and then it covers we don't need the meeting you're saying what I can do is I'll put a list I'll take his I'll put it I'll, I'll take both our old questions and yep. his questions and send them out to everybody and every, everybody can reply back to me but only me gotcha on, so I right. think we should use these questions these questions but to ultimately decide on what questions go out we need a meeting okay because so we can give you our suggestions between right. you and right. I, right? Uh, Gary and you only, and then you'll come. You'll make up the list from our suggestions. I'll make a list up from the suggestions. I will make a list up from the suggestions, yeah. but to get consensus on that list, we need a meeting. Okay. So we have to have a meeting shortly to get those out. Correct. So, but it can be a short meeting too. Yeah. It doesn't have to be, right. you know, it can be any time, you know, during the day. It probably only needs to be, you know, 50. We can have a meeting just to say, yeah, those questions right. are good. Let's go. It could be a, can literally could be a five minute meeting. Right. Okay. It doesn't have to be here. It could be, well, I guess it has to be here because they want all of our meetings public. Oh, okay. So, um, on this thing. So, how quick do you think you can get those questions and stuff? Today is Wednesday. I, if I have, if Neil did in give me everything, I can get the list out probably tomorrow. Everybody, we have to post a meeting. Gonna put takes two days of posting, so we could have a, mo so a meeting Tuesday the fifteenth. Because Monday's a holiday. Monday. Oh no, because you're gonna be forty-eight hours, and Monday won't count as a posting day. 
So it would have to be Wednesday, Wednesday sometimes Wednesday. Wednesday. Could be Wednesday morning or late late Wednesday. Doesn't matter to me. Yeah, when Wednesday at four I've got a meeting. Uh, we could do it earlier during could the day. Could we do it early day? Yeah, anytime. Do it earlier during the day on a yeah. Wednesday. Yeah. Yeah, I think Jimmy's right. It's not going to take long. No. We just need yeah. to show up, open show the up. meeting, vote yes. Say yes and go. Close the meeting. What to do with it? A meeting like that, can we do Zoom or no? You can't do I was going to say, Zoom. right, then people would do right in the office. Right. We only have to leave. Because I mean, a Zoom meeting. I know Jennifer can take yeah. that. Right. Yeah, we could do. We could. We could do. We could make. We could do a Zoom time, right? Yeah. I mean, if that works better for you, folks. Yep. Um, you guys fine with me? That would take less time of getting everybody everywhere. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. yeah. Okay. And Jennifer okay. will set it up. I'll, try, I'll set up with Jennifer for a Zoom. So yeah. ten seventeen. Is that right? Yep. In the morning, or, or I got one thirty. Appointment I got to be in Connecticut for, so that'll, that'll I'll be leaving at. So I'll be how do like come what, What's early in the morning for everybody? Six. <laughs> I'm, I'm, I, I could do six. It wouldn't bother you one bit. <laughs> um, I have a training that day, so yeah, six seven would be good. It's what time you got to leave? Eight. What time <laughs> you got to leave? Your <coughs> training? Seven seven thirty. So ah, no, I don't usually leave. Yeah, probably eight o'clock. So we'll leave by 8 o'clock? Yeah. We'll do a 7 30 meeting? Perfect. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. Perfect. Okay. We'll try for that. I'll post it, get everything out. Okay, Susan, so will be quick. That's 17th on Wednesday. <coughs> yeah. 17, 7 30. Uh, on the 24th, uh, what time are we starting that meeting? 1 o'clock. 1 o'clock. Unless we want to start maybe a little bit earlier. Yeah, let, let's get here for like 12 30. Yeah. Yeah, that's a good idea. But first interview will be at one o'clock. First right. interview is at one o'clock. Yeah. But we'll yeah. Just we can nail down, you know. If we have the list of questions, I'll assign names to it. And that way at twelve thirty, if we get here, just so that we make sure we're all here. Right. And if somebody doesn't show up, okay, well, your question will be given to whatever I ask or we're going to do that. Yep. That's fine. Okay. It'll be just cover minutia. All right. Um, we had a wetland delineation completed. Mr. Scott, you want to give us a quick update on that? Uh, yeah, the company came and the delineation was done. I sent Jim, I don't know if he sent it out to everyone, the preliminary result. Uh, but. It ha it, he's add it still has to add it to the plan. Okay. So, but the delineation itself has been done, and there is uh, they're in the works of doing it. Yeah, they're in the works of doing it. So, who did the the uh, delineation? <coughs> was, uh, what was the name? Holberg. Hol 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 no, no, surveyors. Surveyors. Yeah, uh, oh. I'm just curious. Okay. Yeah, I can. So the flags are. The flags are. They, yeah, the flags are they, yeah, very, very minimal flagging. They did most of it uh, GIS. Okay. So it just needs to be put on a survey plan. Yep. Yep. So I, I walked the property uh, the other evening, and I didn't see anything out back. It was all downhill. Yeah, it's all downhill. Down down so yeah. on our really on our property that we're talking about there was nothing other than up front where you created it yeah. Yeah. right g z i g z a i'm sorry yeah g z a yeah. yes that's them okay all right so we talked about the question for the number five we already hit that one chip do what do you would you uh, by Jim to send this out, he has it, or yeah, I'd be curious to look at it. Yeah, uh, yes, because yeah. I, I did send it to you. You, you got it, right? Uh, yeah, okay. I believe I got it. Yeah, I'll, yeah. I'll, I'll I just put it up myself yeah. to send out the results to yeah. If I don't, if I don't, if you didn't give it to me by any chance, I'll that's the one I called you on. I thought my email was acting up, and I reset oh, it. Okay, to yes, okay, yes, yes, yeah. yes, yes, I remember that when I did get that. Yeah. Yeah, there's
there's all sorts of lines and stuff. This and that. I'm sure you would understand yeah, it. Randy, Randy, would understand it what, what it all yeah, means. And Randy probably understands it more than any of us. But I hope so. <laughs> <laughs> uh, let's see. Okay, so we've got. Also, I will send out email to everybody the preliminary results of the wetland study. Um, Randy, does it take them a long time to plot that on a plan, or shouldn't? No, um, if they did it with GPS and they're giving it to Holmberg, because Holmberg's got the base plan. Right? Yeah. So it's just a question of taking it from this computer, putting it in that computer, and plotting it on yeah. in the CAD. So it, it wouldn't take but a few hours, more than likely. Okay. okay. Our next meeting will be 10 17, 7 30 in the morning to uh, verify questions. Yeah. We will meet. Uh, Twelve thirty p.m. on Thursday the twenty fourth ahead of the meet ahead of the one o'clock interviews. And we should be done accordingly. I gotta give the binder what Jennifer is referring to about I don't know if you were even on the you was yeah, you might have been how long have you been on the work for the town? Gary uh, this time thirteen years. Mm -hmm. It'll be close. There was a committee set up multiple years ago. I'll give you an idea of how long ago it was. So you know, you probably weren't even aware of the town. I left it. Peace out. Yeah, well, right after I left the first time. Um, Pat Kelleher, myself. I don't know who the was other Tim was. That one or Tim's wife? What was Tim Nyhart or his wife on that one? Or no? Mm, no, I don't okay. think so. I know there was one like shortly after I left it. Like and. Really uh, the guy that was basically the DPW maintenance guy at the time. Scott. I'm trying to think who it was. Not Scott. No, not this Scott. I don't know. Ingram? Ingram. No, or, oh, no, no. Before him. Before him. Anyway. Sam, Sam Martula and then John Wash. No, no, not, not, not the mechanic. Not the mechanic. No, the first, the first guy they hired was, what's his name, I think from uh, Tremor Road. Any, yeah, anyways. Um, and they wanted us to put together uh, kind of a review of the town garage and expand it. So we ended up with just building a building. And I remember the, I can't think of the guy's name. I can see what it looks like, but that's about it. And it's in the book anyways. And if Jennifer can still scan it, I'll even see if I can scan it. And I can send it out to everybody just for reference. Just as a, just a quick story here. And he was adamant about putting in a wash bay, about doing this and doing that. And the other committee guys were like, we just wanted to put up a bigger, you know, a more, a, a bigger building for uh, laying out the garage. And so the select board says, yes, that was it. That was good. Everything go forward with it. So we put out an RFQ for designers got like three responses and a board of selectmen dropped the ball after that. We never interviewed anybody, um, never did anything beyond putting out the RFQ and it was just fell apart. And the guy that was in charge of the, the, the maintenance guy that, that I talked about quit or left the town garage for whatever happened shortly after that. So the whole thing just kind of fell apart and they just ended up with that study and that was all that ever happened. So that's, that's gonna be the only other study that I can think of that was ever done for this thing. Uh, we had a, a kind of a layout, if I remember there was a footprint of what the building would look like. I know that I remember hearing that it was supposed to be where the fuel islands were and they just put those in and that was like a big yeah, I didn't want to get involved with that. Yeah. I think that's had a big so. decision to make on that. But anyways, that that's kind of what I think that's the one Jennifer and Rory talking about. But that study was that's that's like quite I a said, while ago. Pat Caliber and Pete Salvatore were yeah. both on a committee. They both passed away many many years ago. Yeah. So it's going to be twenty years ago anyway that that was done. So, all right. Um, I have nothing else. Make a motion to adjourn. Is anybody have anything? Nope. Nope. Everybody's good? Yep. Motion. Second. 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 All in favor?
favor? Aye. Aye. Meeting is history. Thank you, everyone. <laughs>